In this video, I will show you how to use your PS5 controller for Genshin Impact on your PC. So let's jump straight into it. So I know you guys can see that I've got a Mac in front of me, but this is currently running Windows. So in order to do this, there's two ways you can go ahead and connect your controller. So the first way to connect this is using the USB Type-C charging cable that comes with your PS5 controller and you can directly plug that in or alternatively you can go ahead and connect via Bluetooth to your PC. So if you want to go ahead and connect via Bluetooth well, I'll show you what to do. So the first thing you're going to want to do from your desktop is come down to the search box down in the bottom left hand corner. And in here, you just want to go ahead and type Bluetooth. And once you've done that, if you look underneath best match, you're going to see here Bluetooth and other device settings. So just go ahead and click onto this to open it up. From here, what you're going to want to do is come and turn on your Bluetooth. And once that's done, just come up to the button above, which says add Bluetooth or other device. Now that's going to bring up a screen like this. Now, before you go ahead and press anything from here, what you're going to want to do on your controller is put this into pairing mode. To do that, go ahead and press both the PlayStation button and the share button at the same time. So you just want to hold these two buttons down until the blue light starts blinking on your controller. And once it starts blinking, this shows we're now in pairing mode. So next what you're going to want to do is come back to your desktop and you want to select the top option here for Bluetooth. So just go ahead and give that a click and it's going to start scanning for any nearby devices. After a second or two it's going to come up in your list of devices. You can see the DualSense wireless controller here. If it's not coming up make sure that the lights are still flashing. And what you can do is select this from the list to go ahead and connect to your controller. So now, as you can see, our controller is connected to our PC and we are all good to go. The next step after this is to go ahead and open up Genshin Impact on your PC. So once your controller is fully connected to your PC, if you open up Genshin Impact and come into the settings, and there's an option for controller setup. So by default, this should actually set up and map the controller for you. And this is basically what it looks like for the PS5 controller. As you can see, it does automatically map this, but you can change the controls if you want to. Once that's done, you can now go ahead and play Genshin Impact on your PC using your PS5 controller. So that is how to go ahead and use your PS5 controller to play Genshin Impact on your PC. I hope this tutorial did help you out today and if this did help you out I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.